going to try and see if I can walk you through the process uh, for uh, getting launch control active on your 335 IS and in some cases overseas uh, your 335i with the DCT. So I'm going to attempt to walk you through the process of um, setting up launch control. Alright, so there's three things you have to do uh, in order to get launch control to work properly. Um, and the three main things, there's a, there's a slight 3.1 or whatever you want to call it, but there's three main things. You have to turn off traction control, which is just a one press with that, and you see it's in the dash indicating right up there. And then you have to set your drive selector to drive in a manual shift mode. And then the third is to make sure sport button is pressed. Um, with all those three things set, you have uh, one more thing to kind of do, and it's um, it's to put it in M1, which is either uh, clicking this paddle down to the manual mode, or just putting the gear lever up, um, and essentially it'll it'll put it to M1. Now you follow up with the uh, your left foot on the on the brake and then you put the right foot on the accelerator all the way past the kick down so essentially flooring it and you should um, you should see the the flag indicating you're ready for launch control all right we're gonna attempt to do this and see if it works ready go So as you can see, the, the car was ready to launch. It was in the launch control mode. Um, and essentially, once you have the flag, all you have to do is just release the brake pedal and the car will do the rest. Your results may vary with it, depending on the temperature and all that kind of stuff, but um, good luck with that.